I'm again with you and happy to see you. Today we will have the new interesting story for your good sleeping. And I hope you feel well and ready to listen. So sit down more comfortable and listen to our next story. This will be modern story, the secret of work. This story will be with a deep moral. Let me enjoy telling you this story. Once upon a time, there lived a king in southern India named Sviranacharya. He was very curious to know about his village. One day, he called out a group of courtiers and said, Go and find how the people of my village are, and bring the person who knows about the secret of work. But one condition, any person you meet, he should not know that I send you. The courtiers didn't understand the king, and they walked away. The courtiers thought about what to do the whole night. Each of them got a plan and they said to each other, but all the members liked the plan of Rahu, a clever person among the other courtiers. And they all agreed to do the, his plan. The very next day they all dressed as tribals and they arranged a ball of cart with them, and they went around. First, they saw a woodcutter who was cutting down trees. They went to him and said, Do you like this job, sir? The woodcutter replied, No, I do it because this work comes from our ancestors. So. I was forced by my parents to do this job. The courtiers said goodbye to Woodcutter and walked away. While traveling further, the courtiers saw an angry washerman, and they decided to talk to him. One of them asked, Hello, sir, we come from East India, and we are new to this place. We've come to visit our friend Ram who lives here somewhere nearby. Could you please tell his address? The washerman said, Are you mad? Can't you see what I'm doing? I'm doing an idiotic job. The courtiers asked him, Sir, do you like this job? The washerman continued angrily, No, when I was small, I didn't show much interest in studies, and I never listened to my parents, so I become a washerman, as I should look after my family and earn and live to feed my family. I do this job. The courtiers apologized for disturbing and went away. Then they made up their minds to live the job and send a message to the king that no one in the village knows about the secret of work but suddenly they saw a small hut with five candles and three lamps and a man studying a science book and one of them said that it was a school they went inside and asked the lecturer the same question he was wondered, and the lecturer replied, I love this job, and it gives me satisfaction and happiness to teach so many uneducated children. Hearing this, courtiers took the lecturer to the king, and the king appreciated him for knowing the secret of work, and soon he became the best teacher in the village and was given an award and soon a big school was built. So 
the moral. Any work you do, do it good. It doesn't matter what is work, but you have to have some interest in that. If you want to achieve great heights, believe in yourself, and then you can know that work is worship. My dear, I hope you like this story because it's very good and have a very deep moral. I like it too much. So I uh, would like to tell you this moral one more time. Any work you do, it doesn't matter. But you have to have some interest in that. If you want to achieve great heights, believe in yourself and then you can know that work is worship and now it's time to sleep subscribe to my channel and come to me one more time i will improve my stories and my videos close your eyes put your head on pillow and sleep kisses from me